So welcome everyone to today's video, hope you guys are doing okay and in today's video I just want to quickly talk about my channel now. Now the first thing I want to say is for the lack of uploads, I've, I've, I've explained it before but basically uh, I'm going to say it again, I've got exams in like two months so I'm revising for them but obviously I will try to upload still fairly frequently so maybe once a week. Uh, I think that's fair enough because you know I've got to revise most days and yeah the, the exams are coming up quite quickly now so but yeah the, once they're done then YouTube's gonna be my main priority and there'll be way more uploads in the summer so that's the first thing I wanted to say now the next thing that I want to say is actually about my content now I recently put out a poll on Twitter and it got a quite a well a surprising uh, result in my opinion now the, the the poll was what videos do you prefer from my channel now it was either my older videos or my newer videos obviously my newer videos being the one with face cam and reacting to stuff and my older ones being the commentaries the tutorials and stuff like that and and it was very big a lot of you guys it was I think it was like 70 odd percent preferred my older videos so again I'm gonna be switching the content uh, I'm not 100% just doing commentaries and tutorials, I'm going to be mixing it up, but it will be mainly commentaries, because that's what you guys like the most, and I want to be showing you guys the content that you like, so that's the main thing. And let's just get into today's video. So today's video is a collab actually with the Prodigy, also like Prodigy Gamer. Uh, I'll leave a link to his channel in the description so you guys can go check him out. Sub to him because he does really, really good quality videos. I love his thumbnails as well because they're, they're exactly like the same throughout his channel which is really good and I would love that for my channel so um, but yeah go check him out but in today's video we're gonna be talking about top five things youtubers actually forget now some of these things I am actually I've actually done before I'm sure Prodigy has as well now I'm gonna be doing the first three tips and Prodigy will leave it off in the, the last two now the, the first tip about this video is actually the channel name and links so they're both sort of linked together so first thing channel name obviously people forget about having an actual good channel name because some, some people actually have a really bad channel name where it's just numbers and stuff like that you need to have a channel name that's linked to your content and also that sort of is easy to say and not too long now my one obviously used to be on Ethan HD and I removed the HD just because it, there was no point in having it on there every video is gonna be in HD now so uh, it's just ultimate Ethan, which I think is better links as well you need to have your links in the description People forget to put their Twitter, their Twitch, their Snapchat, their Instagram, every social media they have. They always forget to put them in. Now, what you can do on YouTube, uh, on the settings, I can't quite remember where it is, but you can go on your settings on YouTube and actually make sure that you have set descri description always in there when you upload, so you don't have to keep typing it in. Now, most of you guys would probably have that, but just check it. Make sure you've got everything in there. And that basically the first tip. Now the next tip is actually the audio quality. Now what I'm talking about here is that you need to have good audio quality. You need to have a good mic. Now the mic I have is the Blue Snowball. I'm not quite sure what the Prodigy J has, but his audio quality is really good, if not better than mine. And yeah, you it, it shows. You, you know, people enjoy listening to you because the audio quality is actually quite crisp and quite nice. Uh, so yeah, hopefully this audio quality is good, but uh, yeah, the audio quality, you need to have a good mic, you need to spend that little bit more money on getting a new mic, because you, you, you use the mic in every single one of your videos, so it's not like an Elgato where you use it sometimes, or a camera, but the mic er, you use in every video, so you need to have a good one. I recommend getting the Blue Snowball, because it actually is a fairly good price, and very good quality as well. Now my third and final tip that you need to remember to, ha to have a good quality channel is actually your channel art. Now what I'm talking about here is your thumbnails and your banner and profile picture and obviously like overlays and stuff like that in your video. So first off thumbnails. I remember if you guys remember if you still subscribe to me but from them days but if you remember my channel review spotlight I always went on about thumbnails and I'm, I still I still have the same opinion thumbnails are really really important because if you have just if you don't actually have a thumbnail anyway if you don't have a thumbnail then it's just gonna be something in the video that won't really attract many viewers but if you have a custom thumbnail with amazing text and fonts and graphics or you can get someone else to do it if you want but yeah if you have good quality thumbnails it, it attracts more viewers to your channel obviously gaining you more views and subscribers 
and yeah, your channel banner also has to be good. You can't have a really bad, you know, used from like Microsoft Paint or something. It has to be good quality. If you're not very good at making banners, either get a template or ask someone on Twitter to do it for you. Some some people are quite expensive, some people aren't, so it's up to you how much you want to spend. But that concludes my tips. I'll, I'll leave it to Prodigy for the fourth and the fifth tip. Hey guys, my name is Prodigy, and if you don't know me, my channel is full of quality content that's more to help you guys, and if not, entertain you at the same time. So I do recommend checking that out, but anyways, for tip number four, you guys want to use tags in your videos, because they can help your videos appear on the first search page for that tag. Now a nice tool that I like to use in my videos is the extension called TubeBuddy. And it's basically a tool that can help you guys out on your videos. So in TubeBuddy, if you use the Tag Explorer tool, you can type in any tag and get a score on how good it would be in a video. Which when using TubeBuddy, you want to try and make relevant but unique tags for your videos because if you use tags that are like phase or optic, you're basically wasting tag space if those tags don't relate to your video one bit. And you want to make sure that you use unique tags so you can get a better score when using tags in TubeBuddy. Also, if you have trouble thinking of unique tags, I suggest looking up the video idea you're going to be doing and look at other people's tags and reword them differently so they get a better score in TubeBuddy. And because the higher score, the more chance your video will be shown on the first search page for that tag. Ending up the video of tip number 5, you gotta learn engagement meaning you gotta try and be known and interact with others cause you're gonna have trouble getting your channel out there if no one has heard of you. So I do suggest that you go tell your friends about your YouTube channel and yes I do know some of you guys might not want to do that cause you might feel embarrassed but if you honestly believe you have quality content on your channel then you shouldn't be nervous to tell your friends and maybe some of your family members if that. Also, when you're trying to tell others about your channel, do it in a considerate way, meaning don't spam on other people's videos because that's just annoying to them. And finally, try to interact with other YouTubers and fans on other social media like Twitter because then you can make new friends and build a stronger relationship with your fans. And who knows, you might be able to get a few subscribers here and there from it. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed having me on here and if you want to check out my channel, a link to it will be in the description down below and I'm going to hand it off to Ethan. So that was today's video guys, hope you guys did enjoy it, hopefully you have actually learned some things today and hopefully you've been reminded of what to do on your channel and maybe what you're forgetting to do as well, which is the whole thing of this video, but yeah, um, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy it, if you did, make sure to smash that like button down below, that would be really amazing if we can hit the golden like goal which would be 30 likes at the moment uh, that'd be absolutely amazing that would really make my day so make sure you hit that like button uh, and also subscribe if you are new so that is going to put up please like subscribe and peace